Hi, problems occur and from time to time I have here uh, hard disks which are already grouped meaning there is already code somewhere on the hard disk that, uh, that there has been a previous uh, Linux on it then this hard disk becomes a secondary hard disk, a backup hard disk but the group sectors and all that stays and in the end I had also Windows 8 and well everything went wrong went sour as they say this is a neat program that saved the day I must tell you that so boot repair comes on the official Ubuntu website I will post a link and it's a simple tool to repair frequent boot issues you may encounter in Ubuntu like when you can't boot Ubuntu after installing Windows yes it, it was the case it was a Windows and a Linux installation, a dual boot. Let's you fix these issues, etc. etc. You can read it as well. So, well, what do we do? Let's make a copy for later on because we're going to forget it and we're going to make Ctrl C a nice little script for later and save it somewhere in the cloud. Empty document is going to call boot repair. You can have uh, empty spaces in between the title but it's just your choice if you don't want to see it anymore and just do your thing you put minus y and this is not the case because it's already here okay so you save this but you can't save it if you click it it just opens so you have to do properties permission execute close run run in terminal this time I showed another movie grub customizer I just run it in terminal let's do it this time with this way so right mouse, mouse click open in terminal and then dot slash boot repair boot repair I do this with a tap so I don't have to type everything so boot tap gone we are installing so one of the first lines we saw maybe I can get back to it where is it yes there is so here you get uh, the first line you are about to add the following PPA that's the PPA edit boot repair then it says ok imported successful and all that processes processed scroll 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 is going to update it's going to look what is in this resource there are some duplicates I saw I could not grab your mouse, ok, no problem here, setting up boot repair, so it's already set up or you go and you type boot etc, enter or I suppose we can find it somewhere here which is preferably better, so installing I do in the terminal running I do here just in my desktop environment as I call it, the DE Here's the program, it's, it's starting, it's booting, it's looking, it's finding my system, it's finding out what can I do and uh, you can have some more information here available recommended repair um, let's, let's, no, let's do it like this recommended repair, repairs most frequent problems of if you think okay, let's go with that create boot info summary, you get help by email I've done this, it's incredible, it's really incredible but then it says, okay, you have to install this. Do you want to do that? Yes, okay, let's do it. So it's going to install this, this program of paste bin. I thought it was, when it was the quick, forgot it already. <laughs> so it's going to install extra software. And this uh, analysis, actually, it's an it's a analysis of all your computer hard drives and th stuff like that, and the groups. And it's going to post that in paste bin so you can have a link later on if something goes wrong and say okay this went wrong and uh, please no? so this is the URL unified resource locator and you go to the website and you see all your personal information is online everybody can see this now so this is my x4 and xdsda so all the partitions this is my first hard disk no? and there's the partition, another partition, another partition with an X4 and, and a swap and then again Rebecca and here is the boot files, the boot and the grub um, 
etc. So uh, you can get really, really a lot of details as you can see. Yeah. This I I was very, 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 very pleased with it. My computer was well damaged. Let's say it like that. I wanted to say another word which I can't use in the movie. Yeah. It was damaged, so the boot repair really saved the day. And I wanted to share that with the world here. So that boot repair, try it out, uh, of course, if you have something going wrong. Otherwise, just keep off and just have fun with your Linux. And that's the message. Bye for now.